Hello everyone, welcome to another video. And this video we I'm gonna talk about what are inventory levels. It's really very important topic to understand what are inventory levels. So there are different kind of levels and we if you work in inventory, you're planning to work in inventory or you doing a study related to inventory, then this can help you in understanding inventory levels. So First is back order. Back order inventory uh, level is it's a level or mainly what is back order. Back order is when you receive request for the inventory that was not immediately available, and it's mainly you receive the order but you are not able to fulfill the order at the time it's in. You can say it's in it's in process or it's in expanding and if you read a customer request for inventory that was not immediately available when first order typically filled as soon as possible and sent directly to the customer at suppliers expense risk of not meeting terms and conditions of supplying contract or loss revenue if the customer finds alternative so mainly it's back order usually is a uh, is a level of inventory when you can't fulfill on demand orders and you keep the order and then you contact the suppliers you you ask them to dispatch the goods immediately that you need to fulfill this order so that level is known as invent in back order level then in net inventory the inventory that you have in hand plus purchase order plus pipeline inventory minus back order so mainly it's also gonna in net inventory gonna include what you have on hand we're going to receive and what is in pipeline and from that you can just remove all the back orders net stock net stock is the amount of inventory in storage the, st the stock that you have in your warehouse in warehouse that's net stock and same related term is on hand stock is a net stock minus product back orders so mainly on hand is what you have on hand minus back orders because back order is something that need to get delivered you already have but you you can't fulfill them at that moment maybe you don't have sufficient inventory to fulfill them so those order you have to minus from net stock then whatever left is your own hand stock the stock out the stock out is when you don't have sufficient level of inventory then that level of inventory known as stock out that is stock when your inventory is no longer for any use mainly when you when it get expired or there is some change or recall sometimes recall is also and sometimes company no longer continue that product so all those kind of inventory become dead stock I hope you understand uh, a basic of inventory level in case you have any doubt then please let me know and thank you